I'm Abhishek, Technical Marketing Engineer for Maxine, and I'll talk about the API guide of NVIDIA Maxine's noise removal feature. By the end of the video, you'll be able to apply noise removal and suppress over 25 different types of unwanted noises from your input audio using its easy to use API. So without further ado, let's dive into it. Before getting started, make sure you have met all the required dependencies for running Maxine Audio SDK. Also, going through resources on CUDA computing platform will be beneficial. CUDA is NVIDIA's parallel computing platform, which can be used for running general purpose computation on NVIDIA GPUs. NVIDIA Maxine Audio Effects SDK comes with the following effects. Noise removal, or also referred as denoising, that reduces unwanted background noise from an input audio. Room echo removal, or de-reverb, which reduces reverberations or echoes from an input audio and a combined noise removal and room echo removal model that applies both of these effects in an optimized way. Let's take a look at how to code and use denoising in this video. Out of the box, Maxine's Audio Effects SDK comes with an effects underscore demo sample application. It can run any of the audio effects features on your input audio. You can pass the name of the effect, in this case the denoiser, the sampling rate of input audio and the feature model provided with the SDK for your GPU platform. Next is real underscore time or delayed effect. Intensity ratio is a float value ranging from 0 to 1 where a higher value indicates stronger suppression. A value of 0 means no effect will be applied. Finally, pass the input and the output file name. Using the API to develop an application like this is a simple three-step process. First, create the effect and set the requisite parameters. Next, load the desired model using nvafx underscore load function call. And finally, run the effect on input audio by calling nvafx run function. As you can see, it's quite easy to run Maxine Audio Effects SDK. Now, let's go a bit deeper into each of these steps. In the first step for creating the audio effect, we need to instantiate a handle object and pass it to create effect API along with the effect selector, in this case nvafx underscore effect underscore denoiser, and check for errors if any. The next step is to set the default GPU using set u32 API call. Similarly, we can set the sampling rate with the same API call. Next, the correct model path has to be passed using the setString function. And finally, with the nvafx underscore setU32 function, we set the number of audio streams to be processed by the audio effect. Additionally, we can set other parameters like samples per frame and intensity ratio using the setU32 and setFloat function. Step 2 is to load the model using the nvafx underscore load function. You'll need to pass the handle created in step 1 as an argument to this function. Make sure the noisy input files are also loaded into the RAM at this point. Once the denoiser effect is loaded, running it on the input is as simple as calling the nvafx underscore run function. When the effect is run, the contents of the input memory buffer are read, the audio effect is applied, and the output is written to the output memory buffer. The run function expects the handle previously created, the input and the output buffers, and the number of samples per frame and the number of channels of the input audio. When an audio effect is no longer required, it should be destroyed to free the resources and memory allocated to the effect. To destroy an audio effect, call the nvafx underscore destroy effect function and pass the handle of the effect to be destroyed. And there you go, with three simple steps, you can easily clean up your audio and improve its quality using NVIDIA Maxine's Audio Effects SDK. Now you can get started by downloading the SDK from the Getting Started page and running the sample application as demonstrated in this video. And by the way, I've been using the noise removal feature for recording this video the entire time. Thank you.